Hello everybody and welcome back to some more Gravely stuff. Right here I've got my diesel repowered C10 set up with a plow on the front and wouldn't you know it we got some snow. So my thinking with the plow blade was hey I'll leave that on for the first few snows. It'll help with the slushy crappy lake effect that we always get and then come January when it snows for real I'll put the blower on. Anyway uh, it snowed for real <laughs> and I think I'm too lazy to go retrieve the blower from my mess so we'll see what the blade does and if it works well we'll keep using it and you know even if it doesn't i, I want to throw snow so the weather says it's 20 degrees outside the thermometer says it's like 30 inside let's see how well this diesel cold starts gotta hit the uh release right here <laughs> great start
I think I'm gonna need the blower. It works all right. The thing is, it doesn't shovel it far enough into the mounds to actually like move it. It just kind of moves it around. Okay, I hauled it inside and I did a little tinkering. I think I know what was up. So I adjusted the governor springs and I turned out the fuel screw a little bit more so we'll get more fuel. And let's see how that does it. I think the problem was that the governor wanted more fuel, but the screw was limiting it. Let's give her a shot.
So there you have it. There is our first blow with the diesel repowered snowblower gravely. Uh, as you could tell, we had some issues, needed a little bit of tuning, had to turn up that fuel screw a little bit. I suspect there's still more in it. We were really dogging in snow that I just don't think we should have. So a little bit of tuning, a little bit of fixing, and I think she'll be mint. Just with preliminary monkeying around, you can see that this thing is actually quite a hammer. Before I wasn't really happy with my smokestack exhaust. It was kind of annoying and hazy when I was just mowing, but when you got some pressure behind it blowing, it's great. It gets that nasty exhaust just right above your head and you don't even have to worry about it. So I think we're still having some issues with the gearing. I think uh, even though this is a diesel, it still doesn't quite want to run like an L uh, Model LT head does. Our big issue is you can really choose between throwing snow or going slow. And when you take the big bites, and throw hard like you would in high gear. It just has issues with the diesel, the gearing, and the big tires, and the dog eater. It's just not too happy. So if we could find a way to be going a little bit slower, I think I'd be happy. What's this then? Gear reduction wheels. Yeah, well, I've been scheming again, but uh, that's gonna have to wait till next time. Until then, thank you very much for watching, and have a good one. Shoots!